Hi, welcome to our product demo. Today, we are going to create a new internet product. First, we will log in and choose products. The unified product catalog shows the last product specifications we've worked on. We select to create a new product and fill in the form with basic product data. Product line, product type, tax rate, unique code, and name. The application creates a new product specification. The initial status is set to in development. Product characteristics and properties are defined with attributes. At first, a new product has no attributes. Let's add an attribute that will define the Internet's network technology. The value shall be editable and set on product assignment. The value is mandatory, so we set the minimum cardinality to 1. Let's define the value of network technology. This product will only be available on fiber and copper networks, but not on the mobile network. We limit the choices to fiber and copper and set the fiber as the default option. Let's add another attribute that will define the level 2 technology. Level 2 technology may be ADSL, VDSL, or FTTH. The default option is FTTH. At last, we add an attribute that will define the internet bandwidth. The value of bandwidth is defined on the order, so we set the attribute to editable. The value is mandatory, so minimum cardinality should be set to 1. The list of values presents all available bandwidths. Let's remove some internet speeds and set 20 megs slash 20 megs as the default speed. Now let's connect our internet product with a technical internet service. The service is used for service inventory integration and service provisioning. We need exactly one internet service. The service is a non-removable product component. Now let's add some technical resources. First, we need a home communication gateway. This is a mandatory component. Next, we will add an SFP module. And finally, we will add a username. Previously added resources were all physical. Username, on the other hand, is a logical resource. We can now visualize our product configuration. The internet product is comprised of internet service a home communication gateway, an SFP module, and a username. Finally, we will change the status of the internet product from in development to production. We go to the basic product information tab and change the status.
This concludes our product demo. Thanks for watching.